The Christmas Fiasco, written and illustrated by Iris Vega Frias. To all the good kids in the world, you're appreciated and loved. It was the first day of December. A layer of snow was on the ground. Timmy knew what time of year it was. It's Christmas season, said Timmy, bursting out of bed. He got dressed, grabbed a piece of paper and a pencil, then rushed towards the kitchen. Timmy sat down and started scribbling what he wanted Santa to bring him. Look, Mom, I finished my wish list, said Timmy proudly. Timmy's mother grabbed the piece of paper and discovered ten things on his wish list. These are nice ideas, honey, his mother said. But if you want Santa to bring you everything on this list, you have to do good deeds for others. That's how you get on the nice list, added his father, who just woke up. You also can't do bad things on purpose, or you'll end up on the naughty list, Timmy's father continued. Timmy realized what he needed to do in order to get his presents. The next day, most of the snow had melted, but there was still some on the neighbor's driveway. I'm going to go shovel my neighbor's driveway, thought Timmy as he grabbed his father's brand new shovel. On his way outside, Timmy stepped on a bug. He looked down and started panicking. Oh no, Timmy thought. I killed an innocent bug. What's Santa going to think of me now? I can still do good deeds, thought Timmy. One bad thing isn't going to put me on the naughty list. He went to his neighbor's house and started shoveling the snow. As he was doing this, Timmy broke a flower pot that was on the side of the house. Timmy ran home scared. He didn't have any snow boots on, so he slipped on the ice and broke his dad's brand new shovel. He rushed inside, telling his parents everything that happened. He tracked snow inside the house, which worried him more. How many bad things can I do today? thought Timmy. Just because you made some mistakes doesn't mean you're a bad kid, said Timmy's parents. Your good deeds count all year, said his dad. The important thing is that you didn't lie to us about it, said his mom. That year, Timmy got all the presents he asked for. The end.